Hello learners. Now let us see how to find the roots of this uh, cubic equation. If it is given that the roots of this equation are in arithmetic progression. Okay. Now my first statement is that I'm going to take my roots as a minus d a and a plus d. Okay. I'm going to take my roots as a minus d a and a plus d. And these are in AP. You can observe. You see. Uh, you can the common difference is d. If you will add a d to this a minus d plus d, you will get a. If you will add a d to a a plus d, that's what the next term. And these are in AP. That's going to be my First statement. Now, some of the roots, uh, these are my roots a minus d and a plus d. Their sum is nothing but minus coefficient of x square divided by coefficient of x cube. What is the coefficient of x square? See the equation at the top. It's minus 24. That's why here it's minus 24. What is the coefficient of x power 3? It's 4. So 24 by 4, it's nothing but 6. So now let's simplify the LHS also a little bit. Now you see. Uh, minus d and plus d will get cancelled. a plus a plus a is 3a. So 3a is equal to 6. Uh, so basically a is 2. And I'm going to mark it as my 1 because I'm going to use it at a later stage. Now, now I'm going to uh, find out the product of the roots taken 2 at a time. So basically a minus d into a plus a into a plus d plus a, a plus d into a minus d. What is this equal to? This is nothing but equal to coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x cube. Okay, what is coefficient of x? Uh, look at the top. It's 23. And coefficient of x cube is 4. That's why this. Now let's simplify this one on the LHS uh, a little. Uh, multiply this a into a is a square minus ad plus a square plus ad uh, plus this is a, a plus d into a minus d which is nothing but a square minus d square. See, this is what I, this is what I have. Now, uh, if you'll observe minus ad and plus ad will get cancelled and then I'm left out with a square plus a square plus a square which is 3a square. 3a square minus d square is equal to 23 by 4 and I'm going to take it as my 2. Next. Next I'm going to find out the product of the roots. Okay. Product of the roots. A, uh, a minus d into a into a plus d. It's nothing but minus of co constant divided by coefficient of x cube. What is the constant here? 18. What is the coefficient of x cube? It's 4. So that's why minus of 18 by 4. 2 twos are 2 nines are so basically it is minus 9 by 2. Okay. Now let's go ahead. Uh, yeah. This LHS what we would get is see bring the a a little bit side. What is a minus d into a plus d? It's a square minus d square. So a into a square minus d square is minus 9 by 2. And just multiply this one you would get a into a square is a cube and uh, a d square. Here you have it's minus 9 by 2. Okay. Now I'm going to mark this as my three. Now I go, I did the basic things which I need to do now from two. I know that, uh, you know, three a square minus d square is 23 by four. If you remember what was my one, uh, equation one, a is two, right? A is two. That's what I'm going to substitute here. If you remember, I'll just show you to see a is two. That's what I marked it as one. So basically put uh, a as two here. So I'd get three into two square minus d square is equal to 23 by four. This is from 1. Now, what's 2 square 4? So 3 into 4 uh, and what's 3 into 4? It's 12. 12 minus d square is 23 by 4. Now, uh, send this 12 to this side. So I'd get minus d square is equal to 23 by 4 minus 12. Uh, since there's nothing in the denominator of, uh, I mean, it's uh, uh, not given uh, for 12. It's 1. It's basically 1. So now let's take LCM. So I'd get 23 minus 48. This 4 would get multiplied here. 23 minus 48 divided by 4 and minus d square is there on the left side. Uh, here I'd get a minus 25. 23 minus 48 is minus 25. So minus d square is equal to minus 25 by 4. Minus minus would get cancelled. d square is nothing but 25 by 4. Now 25 by 4 I can write it as 5 by 2 whole square. I can write it as 5 by 2 whole square. Therefore d is nothing but d is nothing but plus or minus 5 by 2. It is plus or minus 5 by 2. So I'm going to get two cases. Now, when d is equal to 5 by 2, okay, uh, if you remember what were our roots, a minus d, a and a plus d, right? So a I already, the center root we already know, a we got it as 2. Now, what would be a minus d? Uh, when uh, d is 5 by 2, uh, 2 minus 5 by 2, uh, if you take LCM 4 minus 5 divided by 2, it's nothing but minus 1 by 2. What was our other root? a plus d. So let's find out a plus d. a plus d is nothing but 2 plus 5 by 2. And then uh, again, let's take LCM. So I would get uh, 4 plus 5 by 2, which is nothing but. 9 by 2. So this was, so basically uh, in this 
you know, case we are getting the roots as minus 1 by 2, 2 and 9 by 2 because my roots are my a by a minus d and a plus d. Now, when d is minus 5 by 2, okay, let's see whether we would get the same roots or something different. When d is minus 5 by 2, a minus d would be nothing but 2 minus of minus 5 by 2. It's nothing but 2 plus 5 by 2, which is nothing but 9 by 2. So you see here, you know, uh, the second root like uh, k uh, came here in the beginning. Now a plus d, let me find out a plus d, it's 2 minus 5 by 2. Again, if I take the same, I get 4 minus 5 by 2, it's nothing but minus 1 by 2. So you see, it's just uh, coming ulta. So basically the roots are, ultimately, you know, the roots are going to be the same. Uh, ultimately, we are concerned with the roots, okay? How it's, uh, how it, uh, how it's denoted and all it secondary. So basically my roots are minus 1 by 2, 2 and 9 by 2. These are the roots of the given equation. Thank you. Not just this question, I made many other questions related to theory of equations, wherein, uh, in fact, uh, there are solutions to, you know, fifth degree polynomial, sixth degree polynomial, four degree polynomials as well. There are many, uh, many uh, questions. I mean, my, uh, solutions to many questions which are available uh, in the playlist, and that playlist link would be available in the description. Uh, if this is your first time coming across my channel, please just subscribe to it. And if you like this video, please hit the like button. Thank you.